Good day, everybody. Brian here, quantlabsnet.com. Today is May 17th. This simulation I'm going to hopefully blow your mind with. As you know, we're able to generate um, a variety of future contracts blended with an options, arbitrage, hedging, all that. I'm not going to go into that in detail. But we have here, I believe it's 12 of them. So we've got uh, ES, which is S and P 500, Ethereum, the Euro, Gold. I can't remember what GF is. This is Copper HG, Natural Gas, Gas, uh, Sugar, and Silver. Those are all the different uh, instruments that we have uh, supplied, and and this is the least amount. But then we're able to generate a report here, the summary. So here it is. I'm not going to go into that a whole lot here. But the interesting thing is, is that when you look at um, the usual uh, a breakdown on allocation of, let's say, $100,000, it will suggest, right, right down very specifically on um, what you should use, uh, what kind of strategy, straddle, strangle, long put spread, long call spread and it'll actually give you now this is again for only demonstration purposes using simulated data but it will give you write down how much you should allocate out of the hundred thousand to get profit right so there's that now the funny thing is everything's run in a linux wsl uh, in my case i'm running it in uh, ubuntu so this time around, where I'm really excited is to show you, for the first time, this actually generated a streamlit application, not a Flask uh, application, which I had problems with. So now I know this. This is right up to date info uh, and modern uh, to use streamlit, not use like Flask or anything else. This is pretty killer. So I want to show this to you. Um, this is with Python streamlit's a more of a modern application so I'll bring up the the uh, the uh, dashboard automatically and it's a hundred percent hundred percent Python being in streamlit soon here before I start this simulation uh, part of what I want to show you is uh, there's, there's a charting uh, we've already predetermined to select yes and gold uh, as part of the uh, assets to display the price history on here we have our mock portfolio here's our current uh price action on the uh, bid and ask that i asked to generate uh with the spread and the change as well here we have the price action as, as well um with the volatility the change uh, we've got the option chain. Now, one thing, if you've seen these before, last time, I, if I collect, uh, pick, I don't know, let's say natural gas, it'll it'll update the option chain for me. And again, this is all simulated. Imagine if we got the real true data. Um, or if we chose uh, euro, right? So euro gets uh, updated as well. So this is the first time to get to this point. And then on top of that, we can choose whatever expiry we want for the option. So that's really good. I'm that. um, out of that, we can uh, take a look at the open positions, closed positions. This is another interesting one as well. Here with that report, and I've said this before, this is the exciting part, to be able to take this and it will be fed into an AI to bring back a uh, an actual trading engine all the logic built around it plus the front end and it's all one big script now in python it's about 1400 lines it's very expensive to run uh, it's generated using the latest anthropic with reasoning that's a claude sonnet 3.7 so be able to generate an entire uh dashboard simulation from this again this is what you're looking at is created by ai i've talked about that in the past but to get it to this point where you can actually see all the different types of suggested uh, uh, um, option strategies, right? And um, 
it this is really really advanced i've never seen it like this accelerated trading mode activated um this is all part of the ai that that gives you these options i didn't ask for this these features but i just asked for give me this give me that and it just gave me a lot more based upon data that these ais have and it'll throw on all these extra features you don't even ask for so that's really exciting you can also uh, pick out your days to expiry as well and then as i said you got trading history positions um the option chain uh the pricing action here so you see here we've got all the different um instruments i believe uh they're going to look really kind of weird so the auto trading is off so i'm going to turn on the um simulation and off it goes um so it's going to start um doing things now that are pretty pretty cool uh so here in the dashboard it will give you what it's currently trading uh total equity traded uh, a certain amount of cash available overall p l um and uh gives you the option that you want to trade so let's say if i want to add in um euro let's say if i want to add in ethereum i could do that okay so here obviously we're losing money <laughs> but it's it's all random right but just to be able to get it into the state it's it's really very impressive what you can do with this um uh, this is why i get really excited by this stuff so here's the price action again um here's our active options currently trading es it looks like or um i guess that's a price action for es there's just so many oh i see so you can pick off whatever instrument you want so let's say if i want to look at uh euro again boom there you go and that oh i see that's the price line okay that's the chart itself and here's the options set out wow i didn't even ask for that man that's really impressive silver same thing and imagine you that you are feeding uh real life data into this this is this is this is probably the most advanced i've seen yet um yeah. and again you can check out the option change you want um while it's tr supposedly trading um let's see if there's any oh there's our positions already so because it's i just said please apply high frequency trading strategy go crazy with it yeah so it's it's added um all of these positions so you got long short quantity entry exit p l um unbelievable unbelievable p l so we could see here some big profit here some little ones and then over time what you can do is if you're testing this and the nice thing about something like this is that you'd be able to say okay if i'm constantly losing on let's say es es i'm losing on each position I just say you know what um remove es from those uh positions don't trade them anymore and then i can pre-program that into my prompt in the ai to prevent that from happening and i can just modify the the ai have a new script because it's all one big script and then just redeploy it if i wanted to do that or um in this case um you know just say i would assume no es right here and, and not you know just close that out don't trade es right the other thing i like about here um which is important is we have our open positions here so i can close all these selected positions out unreal this this is to do that manually it's wow 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 so this is easily the most advanced um ai i've come across um you can you can have overriding i didn't ask for that in the prompt here's a trade history um i guess today is the 17th so this is high speed strategy as i asked it and here you go it says 
This has win, got a win ratio, closed trades. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. So now, um, what happens here? Okay, so I know a lot of people get very excited by seeing something like this. Um, well, I just did a interview podcast yes a few days ago that just got posted so you can go to my website to learn about that all i have to do is go into my blog and look for this article here um yeah so this is algorithmic edge crafting future proof future trading strategies and ai driven um and that and if you want to know more you can join my email list uh, lots of stuff's going on. So we're sending out a lot of emails. Uh, first, you get your free uh, C++ HFT book. Uh, I never release your information out. Um, yeah, and then you'd be able to uh, see something like this run. This is unreal. Unreal. Anyways, um, the thing is, the next big step for me is uh, I'll be doing, I've just pulled a very small poll. See who's willing to uh, get access to the free trial. Um, it's quite quite a few people. Um, I'm going to open it up sometime this week. You got to be on my email list. Uh, I'll open it up, but I'm only going to take maybe three to five people into the free trial. Um, I just don't want people coming in and stealing code and whatnot. I have to I have to know who you are, really. Um, this is not going to just be a free for all. Um, I'm still trying to figure out what my limitation will be. Um, but for now, I will open it up to a select number of people, both for the programming, uh, code and, uh, part of the, you know, there's quite a number of projects there I have now. I've got a free file share open to anybody who wants it. Um, plus I've got, uh, my programming elite group, the quant elite programming group, uh, that'll get opened up with all these kind of things that you're seeing, plus the analytics to show you uh, the summary reports along with uh, this. This is the big one here. And then the in individual reports that are shown for each one of these. So uh, that would include the independent report for the ES, independent report for the gold, silver, and so on and so forth. Um, so as 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 I've stated in the podcast I did yesterday, it's complete end to end. It's complete end to end. Okay, you've got the trading idea. Here's the report. Here's the summary reports of the fifty different um, options and uh, different future contracts. In this case, it's only twelve. Um, and voila, we have a trading simulator. Um, and I've always stated in my in my um, in my podcast there. I just want to get it to a runnable state. In terms of the AI code vibing, the AI code generation, whatever you want to call it, with this one, it took quite a bit of iterations to debug and get running. Well, I spent about uh, maybe almost two hours to get this running to where it's at, but to get it to this point, I mean, <laughs> it's unreal uh, where we're at. So I have cash available, nine hundred twelve dollars. I am down uh, thirty-seven thousand. <laughs> but this is this is unbelievable um, to get it to this point. I, I'm just wow. I'm just just amazed that we can actually do it like this. Um, yeah. Anyways, I'm very excited. I've also now proven. Uh, I can do coding on pretty well anything I want. I've got four coding solutions I put up uh, two nights ago. Uh, actually, it was the last night, but there's four new projects in Python that I just found randomly on the internet <laughs> that was recently posted. Uh, so I have Python for that. Um, the thing is that uh, people are going to go, well, I want C++. Understand the C++. If you listen to that podcast, the C++ is very complicated to code generate. The worst part is when you are dealing with the uh, errors, the compiler errors, and the runtime exceptions and, and errors. They're very difficult to debug. So what I'm planning to do is, is take and just stick with the Python 
It's very easy. Here we have the streamlit. It's unbelievable what it's doing. But um, yeah, so I'm very excited by this particular one. Uh, I think I'm going to stick with um, streamlit as as it is right now. This is amazing. Anyways, I'll leave it with that. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.